I've lived in three different apartments since I graduated two years ago, all furnished with IKEA pieces. The idea for shelf probably came out of my latest IKEA spree this month, somewhere in a YouTube rabbit hole of IKEA hacks and DIYs. I wanted my instrument design to be about finding delight in the everyday. The music shelf creates is generative. By interacting with shelf, you reveal new layers, change timbres, and direct the flow of the music. To play shelf, you interact with it as you would any similar piece of furniture. Some of the interactions are intuitive. Pulling out the bottom drawer introduces a low voice, and pulling out the top drawer introduces a high voice. Some interactions are more subtle. Pulling out the door shapes the curve of the melody in a semi-random way. When the door is closed, the melody bounces around fewer notes, and the further the door opens, the more melodic movement. Tapping and holding the knobs in various combinations changes the tempo and timbre, and adds delayed feedback to create more layering. The overall physical design is meant to enforce constraints so that as you maneuver, you create new possibilities. For example, touching all of the knobs at the same time makes the tempo extra slow, but for that to happen, you must configure the drawers so that you can reach all of the knobs. All the while, the music you create is ever-evolving and playful. The current iteration of Shelf was a weekend prototype, and there are many ways to go with future exploration. In keeping with the IKEA ethos, Shelf is easy to expand on. The Calyx unit itself is made to support additions, but you could even furnish a room with a band of Shelf-like instruments with their own personalities. The drawers are mostly empty now, but they could hold MIDI controllers and speakers so that opening parts of Shelf reveals more ways to interact and listen. Thank you.